guys, my name is Emma and let's talk spooky stuff. So today I want to talk about the movie that is Rubber. So I feel like this movie is really hyped up, lots of people talk about it all the time, refer to it, say how it's cool and kooky and different. Uh, I watched it recently and I wish it was better. To be completely honest, I thought of it as a bit of a circle jerk. It has some really good ideas in it, but it lets its ego get in the way of actually being a good story. So bear with me, I'm going to try my best to explain this movie, but it doesn't make much sense. So Rubber Tire has awoken and is traveling through the desert killing anything in its path. It then falls in love with a woman and follows her to a hotel where it has some kind of Mexican standoff with the creators of the film. The whole thing with the film is it does have this different aspect which is there is a live audience there watching the movie as it's happening real time with binoculars and it is like a commentary between them and the actual movie but the fact that the movie lacks any storyline at all kind of downfalls the whole thing. I feel like I know what they were doing. They were trying to make it really simple. They had this idea about an audience watching a movie live and it actually happening and then the actors are just there because they're doing the movie. When you watch it, it seems like, yeah, that's a clever idea. That's really clever and cool and kooky, but what's the point if the storyline for the actual film is nada, like there's nothing. And it made me really sad. I really did want to like this film. What I want to say is just because you're really clever about something and you do a unique storyline doesn't mean it's going to be automatically received really well. It doesn't mean it's automatically a good storyline either. You have to be clever but still have something that's worthwhile. People aren't going to watch a movie just because they think the director's clever. They're going to watch a movie because they think the storyline's clever. And if that falls down, you have nothing. I know the whole point of this movie is there is no point and they make that clear from the start, that's their clever little antidote and their overall meaning, but you still gotta get something out of it and I got nothing. What I did find really interesting about this film though is that it's actually a French film. Though it is spoken in English and it has American actors and it's set in America, it's actually a French film. It's produced by a French production company and the director is also French. I'm gonna give it the personal score of 3, uh, scare score 0, it's a fucking rubber tire. And originality, I'm gonna have to give it a 9. To be honest, it is original so I'm not gonna take any points away from it but it doesn't mean it's good. <laughs> I don't know if you guys agree with me or not. Please let me know down in the comments. Um, I'd love to hear your opinions and your take on this film. And I'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Stay spooky. Bye.